Imagine uploading 1,019,855 videos to your YouTube channel. Well, today we're going to be looking at this channel because it's secretly owned by Google. And there's a really good reason to why they've published so many videos. But to fully understand why they do this, we need to go back in time to around 2014. Now, back in 2014, there was this YouTube channel named Web Driver Torso. And this channel caused a lot of drama. You see, this channel was uploading one video every three minutes. And these videos would be about 10 seconds long. All they contained was a few coloured squares and rectangles and this really annoying noise that would constantly play throughout the video. People started to believe that this channel was a part of some bigger conspiracy, thinking that throughout these videos would be some hidden code and if somebody decoded it, it would lead to something massive. But during 2014, a few articles came out from Google saying that they actually owned this channel and the reason for the videos are for testing purposes. These videos would contain this noise and the footage on the screen so that they could test their quality and processing. Web driver torso would become such a big thing that Google would end up adding Easter eggs to YouTube and Google. And if we fast forward to today, they haven't uploaded a video in two months. The most recent video on the channel is titled Generated 10 Minute Video, which is a completely different title to every other video. And also the big thing is that this one is 10 minutes long instead of 10 seconds. It's the same sort of video with the rectangles and squares, but it's just a longer video. And the reason they're not uploading anymore could just say to you that they think their system is perfect. They no longer need to run these tests as the stuff they've built is already at its peak until I found this other channel. Now this channel is titled Better Banday and they've uploaded 1 million videos to the channel, even though they were only created one year after Web Driver Torso. Now this channel uploads one video every other minute and they're all 31 seconds long. And as you can tell from the thumbnails, it's the same sort of stuff, a bunch of squares in different colors. And in fact, more colors than Web Driver Torso, which makes me believe that this system is more advanced. You see, these colors are only in the thumbnails and the videos are pretty much the same same as Web Driver Torso's videos. So I think the thumbnails are testing the processing of thumbnails on YouTube, just like the videos do for video quality. Now if we take a look at these videos titles, they all follow the same sort of structure. They say video, then hashtag SFTP dash GCS dash PKG, and then the date. And from what I know, GCS PKG means Google Cloud Storage Package, which tells you that the system that is running this channel is run off the cloud. And there's not somebody editing all these videos together and uploading them every minute. Well, kind of. You see, on the channel there is this video titled My Web Video and this was uploaded in 2018. This video would just be the person who is behind the channel looking over their work desk and in the video you can actually see a few hats on the side of his desk. These hats are known as Noogle hats and they are given out to Google employees when they first join the team. A guy by the name of Andrew Brown tweeted out saying on your first day of Google you are gifted a colourful beanie hat with a propeller. It's called the Noogle hat because the people who wear them are new Google employees. You know, new and Google merged together, new Google, you get it. So this is pretty much proof that the person who runs this channel works at Google. But what doesn't make sense is for them to upload this video of a desk tour on a channel that has only been uploading squares and colors. And also something to point out, this video is vertical. Who's uploading vertical videos back then? It doesn't really make sense. Until we take a look at the dates. You see, this video was uploaded on August 3rd, 2018, which doesn't really really mean anything until you search up that Musical.ly and TikTok merged together back on August 2nd, 2018, a day before that video is uploaded. Now, obviously there is no proof behind what I'm going to say, but I believe that this video was one of the first videos that was used to test the current YouTube Shorts feature. YouTube at the time must have seen that these two companies were merging together and realized it could become something bigger than we know. So they got the guy who runs the test account on YouTube to upload a vertical video so that they could all work on the YouTube Shorts feature. You see, features on YouTube don't take weeks or months, they take years. It's such a big platform owned by Google and there's thousands of people who have to work on them that the YouTube Shorts feature didn't just come around during quarantine. It had to be worked on for a good while now. So it only makes sense to me that the YouTube testing account would upload a vertical video so that they could test the YouTube Shorts feature. But there is this one final massive thing that this channel has uploaded and well, it's one of their thumbnails 
thumbnails. You see, what you're looking at right now, I believe to be the back end of YouTube. As you can see, it says YouTube Con 2, which I believe to be YouTube Console 2. There's also a few words that say channel information for thumbnail manager, and there is two arrows pointing to average outgoing timeout and average timeout trimming. Now, I can't lie to you. I have no idea what any of this means. On the left side, you can see a bunch of things, and the only thing that stands out to me is YouTube Key Store. And even then, I have no idea what it means. If I had to take a guess, I'd assume that these are the stats of the testing channel, so they can know what errors and things the channel is making. But other than that, it's just a bunch of words and graphs. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.